say it is not only the culture and language, but it is the national character of Kashmir that is at, at the brink of extinction because of the domicile law, which has been designed to change the demography of Kashmir, which has been designed to make the people of Kashmir minority in their own homes. And this is posing an existential threat to the nation of Kashmir. So the Kashmiri diaspora has only two choices. We have only two options. The option number one is either to hang on to our own organizations or the option number two that we must work with like-minded persons and like-minded organizations to face this challenge and pursue the Kashmir cause at the international scene. India is trying its best to delegitimize the struggle of Kashmir. In fact, Dr. Intiaz Khan knows it well that India is creating an impression in Kashmir, particularly within the past two months, because of domicile law. Azadi is a dream. You cannot get the Azadi anymore. September is important because in September there is going to be the United Nations General Assembly. Dear brothers and sisters, how would you feel? If during the General Assembly session, no one is going to talk about the issue of Kashmir except Imran Khan sir. It will be a disaster for the cause of Kashmir. Then in September also, we have the United Nations Human Rights Council in Geneva. How do you feel if except Pakistani ambassador, no one is going to make the intervention there? Because of the ill health of Gilani sir, because of the detention of Mohammed Yasin Malik sir, because of the house confinement of Mirwal Umar Farooq Saab, our leadership, we can understand it. They are inactive. They are not working the way we want them to work because of their limitation. But we have the alternate leadership which has the support of this leadership. We know them or we need to know them. Then we must lend all the strength we have in order to make them succeed.